Hi students, today we will discuss about the topic of pure functions and impure functions. This function is very important in functional programming. Let us see that. So, pure function. First, let us see what is pure function. Uh, pure functions are the functions which will give exact result when the same arguments passed. Here, note this point. Exact result, same arguments. Here, the function always return the same result for the same arguments. Same result means output. Same arguments mean inputs. If you are giving same input, you will get same output. Next, what is impure function? Impure functions are functions which will give different results when the same arguments passed here it will give different results different outputs for the same arguments for the same input pure function give the same result for the same arguments impure function give the different results for the same arguments okay this means every time you call the function with the same arguments you will always get the same result here, every time you call the function with the same arguments, you will always get the different result. So, next point, it does not have any side effects. Does not have any side effects. Which means, it should not have any external variable. It cannot depend on outside variable so it does not having any side effects but in impure function it should have side effects because it depends on outside variable so it is having side effects then next point pure function do not modify the arguments do not modify the arguments which are passed to them. Here, pure function do not change the arguments. Inputs cannot be changed in the pure function. Here, impure function may modify the arguments. It may change the arguments. So, let us see an example. If you are taking mathematical function sin 0, it always gives the results 0. It always give the output 0. Next, I am writing on code. Let square x return x into x. Here, let us say keyword square x is given. It returns the value what? What value? x into x when you give x value as 5 it returns which value 5 into 5 is equal to 25 here every time you call the function with the same arguments you will always get the same output here in this function square is a pure function because it will not give different results for the same input if you run this function with the same input even 10,000 times or 20,000 times it will always produce the same results. Another one example str len. What is the use of this function? It counts the characters in a string and returns the integer value. If you are taking one example string computer in this string how many characters are there? 8 characters so it returns integer value so the output is what 8 it returns the value as 8 so if you run this function with the same input it always produce the same result next power function this function is used to calculate the power raised to the base value so here if you are giving 2 power 2 it always returns the value 4. If you are calling again and again this function with the same input, it will give same output. 
so this is about pair functions next impair functions if you are taking one example for mathematical function math random here we did not given any argument in the function call even though we did not given any argument into the function calls they all produced different output so this random function is not pure it is impure function next example time if you call this time function now the output will displays the current time if you call the time function after 10 minutes the output displays another on time so here you are getting different results for the same function calls so this is also impure function so you have to remember pure function same input same output in impure function same input different output in pure function no side effects here it is having side effects here it do not modify arguments it modifies the arguments so this is about pure and impure functions this is the difference between pure and impure functions you have to study these answers.